What up, everybody? Good morning. It's your girl, Be Nice Tea, coming straight at you from Channel 54. La Canal 54, the channel Lima Swalufa, the Chanel Lima Food Abad, and the channel Oshitsa. I know, I know. It's been a minute since I've been vlogging. But I don't know what's up. <laughs> I be doing my videos, and then I'm supposed to post them. By the time the end of the day comes, I'm thinking that I posted it, so then I just delete the videos like a dumb dumb. So anyways, it's a new day, it's a new month. Happy August 1st, everybody. Summer is over for me because in a few weeks school starts and um, we're gonna be back on the regular schedule or traffic and everything. So everybody prepare yourselves and enjoy these last few weeks you have of no school and summer break. All right, let's get it started, everybody, with our Monday. Our song for today is My All by Mariah Carey. It's a slow song. It's an older song. But, you know, it put me in a good mood today. So I'm going to share that song with everybody, My All. All right. So let's go over what's been going on for the weekend. Let us share what we've been doing, guys, on this Monday, Monday. It's not a manic Monday. I'm just gonna call it a Monday Monday. All right, let's get it started. Let me see what I can remember what I did over the weekend. Let's see, Friday. Friday, I had a good day. I went to lunch with my friend from work, my chingu, Korean. And we had a nice uh, Korean lunch. And we got to catch up. And it's always good to catch up with um, friends. We used to work in the same building and different department same building for years and then she was moved a few years ago so um you know it really does make a difference when you move to a different building because then you're not forgotten but things that you do in your building it's like just the people in your building that's what you do and you kind of like um just keep it pushing but then it's not that we forget them but it's because they're in a different building it's harder for them to come over and we only have like some of us have 30 minute lunches, some of us have hour lunches, so it just depends. So just wanna let you know, T, I did not forget about you. So that was good on Friday, and then on Saturday was a busy day. I had a funeral to attend, and then a wedding to attend. So both events were really nice. Um, the funeral was nice, the family, it's really sad to see the, set, the family, and especially the kids crying. Um, our choir was singing and um, we brought a nice spirit to uplift the family so I thought that was great and then for the wedding on my mom's side we went um, and it was nice and I think there's a couple of components to me that make a good wedding okay first of all it's the planning whoever's in charge has to do really good planning but to me it's the decor if it's nice elegant simple you know and then second is the food. If the food is good and your decorations ain't all that, you, you get a plus. <laughs> and then the third one is the flow of the whole event, the flow of the wedding. Were there a lot of pauses? Were people interrupting? Were you able to continue with your program? Was it smooth? So those are things that I look at when I go to a wedding or any kind of event, you know, to, um, I'm not rating them, but I'm just saying those are the things that I think about when I have events. I would, when I have parties or when I have events, I like to do the things that I like and that I know or that I think that people would enjoy as well. So, I mean, yeah, at times you got to be frugal because, you know, we ain't rich, but, um, you know, trying to just do the best so that I enjoy it, my family enjoys the event, and the people that attend that we've invited to my event enjoy it as well. So those are three things that I look for is the decor, the food, and how smooth the program flows on that day. So it was really good. I enjoyed uh, both events. Uh, yesterday, you know what I do, gas to go to church. You know, everybody needs Jesus in their lives. So I went to church and then it was so hot. I stayed home in my air conditioned living room all day. Ugh. Even at like eight o'clock at night, I went out for a little bit and it was still like, human so yeah come on la what's really going on uh today let's see monday back at work doing that 410 Ooh. and starting off our week so come on everybody let's get it together let's keep it positive it's the first week the first day of the work week fighting 
And I also want to give a mad shout out to my sister, Bernadine. Her birthday was yesterday. Happy birthday, sis. So she's the quietest one out of my siblings. There's, I have two sisters and one brother. She's the quietest one. She reminds me a lot of my dad. Very quiet, just does what needs to be done. You know, she's the behind the scenes girl. My older sister is like the boss. We take um, our directions from her. I'm the funny, mellow one, you know. I'm really cool and mellow. But when you press that wrong, bu that wrong button, yeah, good luck. <laughs> And then uh, my brother, he's just the funny one, just handles his family because he has so many kids. He's funny too. And he's the baby of the family. So want to give a mad shout out. Uh, happy birthday to my sister, Bernadine. Yo, happy birthday. And um, let's see. I don't know if I'm missing anything to share with you guys. I am going to do some reviews on the animes that I finished. I finished Spy X Family. Whoop. I'm going to do a review on that. I'm going to do my review on My Hero Academia. Whoop. And I want to give a mad shout out to my little my little niece, Ivy. Yeah, she's doing better. I'm so happy. I'm thrilled that she's doing better. And um, she is day by day just progressing. And that's all we can ask for. So everybody, make it a great day. I come on here. I try to be positive. If there's anything that is weighing you down, all I can say, my advice to you is we got to let it go. I have so many friends and people that I know that have passed away from heart attacks, from cancer, and I just pray that they were able to do the things that they've been wanting to do. And so a lot of my family and friends are, are leaving us at an early age, and so I just pray at, that, the, um, that everybody takes care of themselves, that we be positive, and if anything's weighing us down, we need to let it go and move on. Keep it pushing, guys. That's what we need to do. So that's my advice to everybody. Let it go keep it pushing and let's make it a positive day and let's try to make it a positive and prosperous life okay guys i'm out of here what i would say make it a great day i'm out